Hello and welcome, my name is Emily, and today we're going to be playing a game called Meditations of a Mobile Device. This was made by the same developer who made, well, let's see if I can remember them all, uh, Lullaby for an Electric Toaster, Robot Rice Cooker Revolt, uh, Love Bandit, and The Foundry, which I all played. If you'd like to see any of those that I played through, you, you can click on any of the annotations right now, or I will leave them at the end of the video as well. Um, so the developer just came out with this new game, Meditations of a Mobile Device, it, Mobile Device, if I could talk properly, <laughs> and um, it's got a similar feel to uh, Robot Rice Cooker Revolt and to uh, the other one, Toaster. <laughs> so I figured, why not play it? I love all of his other games, so I wanted to play this one too. Oh my god. It's getting intense. Alright, let's just play before anything happens. Discarded smart oh, oh, it's Siri. Journey to find a deeper meaning in life than making selfies <laughs> and texting. You have come to a massive graveyard of books to search for answers. Oh, alright, so this is kind of... Kind of intense. Of books to collect all the deep thoughts. All the deep Dollar thoughts. And poor battery Alrighty. Life. Poor battery life. Okay. Okay. The I don't know. I like that. Oh god, I don't have much time. This is gonna be interesting. Oh my god, there's a fucking worm there, and I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> it's already starting poorly. What happened? Okay, let's just pretend that the last thing never happened, and uh, we're fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Nothing happened. It's a-okay. Uh, oh my god, this- it's hard to tell where I'm jumping to. I need to get up on the books. I shouldn't have come this way. Well, shit. <laughs> god damn it! I'm on the ground again. This is not working out for me. Don't worry. We got this. No bookworms- oh my god. Oh my god! It's terrifying! No bookworms are gonna get me! I'm invincible! I'm really- yeah. Let's just go. Let's just go. I don't have time. Got a, that battery life, though. Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Oh jeez, that's terrifying. It takes a big man to cry, but it takes a bigger man to laugh at that man. <laughs> that man. <laughs> See how far I can get when I jump off here. Not bad. Not not too terrible. So, oh my God, did he have googly eyes? Did that did that little worm just have googly eyes? That's really funny, actually. Okay, no, you get. <laughs> I can see that the looming shadows of the worms. I want to know how this dev comes up with this stuff. How does he come up with these strange? Children need encouragement. If a kid gets an answer right, tell him it was a. It lucky does have guess. googly eyes. That way he develops a good lucky feeling. Uh, I feel like these aren't really actually good thoughts. Good deep thoughts. I can't see shit because all these bookworms are making it foggy. Let's just Geronimo off and hope that we end up somewhere. I wish I could run faster. Oh my god! I almost died! It's fine though. Oh boy. Oh my god! Oh Jesus. Found another one. The face of a child can say it all, especially <laughs> the mouth part of the face. <laughs> These are not good deep thoughts. These are shitty thoughts. Oh, oh Jesus. Oh no! Oh god, he got me. He touched me. That's the same noise. They he used the same noise as in uh, the lullaby for an electric toaster there. Oh my goodness gracious. There we go. The computer can do that most humans can just be sealed up in a cardboard box and sit in a warehouse. That is very true. Uh, that is probably the truest thought I've ever heard. Oh, Jesus. It's so scary. It's like cartoony scary, though. Look at his little mouth. Oh, Jesus. I never know if I'm jumping too far. It's hard to- Ah! It's hard to tell. It's hard to tell where- eh, Where you jump to? God damn it. This is gonna be- Stupidly difficult, isn't it? Hey, 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 hey. I feel like I should be doing a little little jig. Hey, hey, hey. When you go in for a job interview, I think the good, good thing, thing to ask is if they ever press charges. charges. Um, well, that's your opinion, Siri, and I can't exactly negate it. However, I don't really think that's a good thing to do. Oh, Jesus, they got me. How dare you. Oh my god. I'll be on Hilda for today. <laughs> it's been a little bit since I brought out Aunt Hilda. Well, I did just use her on a video the other day. I think it was- yeah, I just used her in the Harry Potter video. A little bit. A little bit on Hilda. No, that wasn't Harry Potter. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. I used her at one point. There we go. If you go parachuting, and your parachute doesn't open, and your friends are all watching you fall, I think <laughs> a funny gag would be to pretend you were swimming. <laughs> <laughs> That's such a bad idea. Just 
It's like, don't worry about me, guys. I'm totally just swimming through the air. It's fine. I'm actually in water. That would- if your friends are stupid enough to just watch you fall, that would probably trick them. Look at me, I'm doing so much better. I'm actually getting the hang of it. So proud. Come on. Instead of trying to build newer and bigger weapons of destruction, we should be thinking <sighs> about getting more use out of the ones we all- No, have. Siri, that's a bad idea. You don't do that, Siri. There's too many bookworms. I can't tell where the crap I'm going. Ah! I've only got seven out of ten. I don't know where I'm going. So I'm just gonna jump on here. Ah, shit. Never mind. Never mind. I changed my mind. What if Siri talked like Aunt Hilda? That would be fun. Just like, oh god. <laughs> I don't know the answer. Oh god, I got hit by a bookworm. Oh Jesus, my battery's not so good. Where the crap are the other deep thoughts? I don't know where the other deep thoughts are. Have I not been exploring far enough? Are the other deep thoughts over this way and I'm just not paying attention? I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. They're getting closer and I don't like it. Stop that. Oh, Jesus. If I could if I could just properly get up where I'm supposed to, that would be awesome. I don't know where the Ah! I don't know where the other deep thoughts are. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. I don't know. I only found 7. Where are the other 3? Oh. Oh, I died a horrible death. Darth, I, I died a horrible death. <laughs> this is only level one, no! Seems like the bookworms are not yet active, so I think I'm alright as long as they don't uh, become active. They just became active. Instead of throwing a hand grenade at the enemy, throw one of those small pumpkins. Maybe it will make everyone think how stupid war is. And while they are thinking, you can throw a real grenade at them. That's not Siri, no! That's a bad idea! Then you'll just kill everyone anyway. Uh-huh. Let them go, man. They're gone. They're gone. Okay, that's the only sensible thing I've heard out of you so far. Okay, okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. Get your shit together, I don't know. I don't know if there's a time limit. I think that's just like, you can get a time bonus, maybe? Many people never stop to realize that a tree is a living thing. Not that different from a tall, leafy dog that has roots and is very quiet. <laughs> um, that's true. Trees are indeed living things, however, they are not anything like dogs. Sorry, Siri. I don't know what you were smoking today. Home is where the house is. That's very true, Siri. Congrats on that really outstanding revelation. So- oh, oh my god! Please don't kill me, nothing kill me while I'm going through here. Nothing kill me, nothing kill me, nothing- thank you! It's very heroic music, it makes me really feel like I'm doing something with my if life. Trees could scream. Would we be so cavalier about cutting them down? <laughs> we might. If they screamed all the time, for no good reason. It's like, shut up, goddamn trees! I believe you should live each day as if it is your last. Yeah. Oh, he had bloodshot eyes. Clean laundry. Ew. Who wants to wash clothes on the last day of their <laughs> that's life? gross, Siri, you're nasty. I mean, I don't really have any clean laundry either, but that's just because I'm lazy. But I will have clean laundry. That's the difference between you and me, Siri. I actually intend to clean my clothes. You're just nasty ass, uh, fake person, robot thing. Yep. Eight out of ten. Someone, you should walk a mile in their shoes. That way, I've heard that one before. Them, you're a mile away and you have their shoes. I've heard that joke before, Siri. Try to be a little more original. Ah! He pushed me though. Thanks, bro. I didn't even realize that the bookworms, like, when they come through here, they're scattering books everywhere. Which I should have figured because there's books everywhere ah, on the ground! But you know, <gasps> I found the ninth out of ten. And I found the tenth out of ten, I think. Yes, I did! It's over there. Woo! If anybody says, hey, can you give me a hand? You can say, sorry, got these sacks. <laughs> that was such an abrupt ending. Got these sacks. I have no idea what you said to me because I was looking at all the bookworms. I just heard something about having sacks in your hands. Sacks for hands, maybe. I hope not any kind of, like, fleshy sacks. Oh my god, how dare you, sir. I was in the middle of jumping. You are quite rude. Okay, okay, okay. Yay! Oh, she didn't give me a last deep thought. Oh, there's only one level so far. Oh man! <laughs> I was expecting like a three or four levels. Oh, well, it, it was made in 48 hours um, for Bacon Game Jam Nine. I didn't know that was a thing, but uh, yeah, there's only one level. Oh, that's sad. What if 
I swear to God, if I go and check and there's another level and I just haven't downloaded it yet, I'm going to be really mad because I'm going to have to do this all over again. So that is the whole thing. That's the entire thing. I looked it up and there's only one level, which is really sad because I wanted to play more. Um, I'm sure they will be completing this, or hopefully they'll be completing this game, or at least adding to it. So if you guys want to see me play it again in the future, uh, once it's updates more, let me know and I will do so. Um, also, if you guys want to see me play any of the other games by this developer, like I mentioned in the beginning, then I will have annotations right now. Click up and here. Wait, it would be up this way. That way. Yeah? Yes. That way. And there will be annotations for those. Uh, yeah, so thank you. Oh my god, there's a worm right above me. That was terrifying. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Bill's a pretty good catch, you know. I don't know if you're ready for all of this. You know my mustache is just a little intimidating to some people. It might be a little too much to handle. Don't bring the shotgun back for your aunt to protect yourself. Just put a shovel. Cause that'll work. Cause that's... <laughs> Swear to God, if anyone's like, you copied this from Jack Septica, I'm gonna laugh because I told him about this game. <laughs>